Hi Scorpio, welcome to your reading. This is a general love reading, it may or may not resonate with all of you. Now let's start. First let's shuffle four times. Let's see first what happened in the past, so you better know if this is your reading, if this reading resonates with you. Okay, a very dramatic, conflictual connection in the past. It was a challenging relationship, I think. Someone may have played games as well. Someone may have played games as well, but it was very dramatic. Yes, you, there may have been periods where there was peace and reconciliation, but still very dramatic after that with lots of arguments and not being on the same page for different things. Now let's see about your current energies. Now you may not want to hear from them, even an apology. And you may think they will not send an apology to you. But you need a conversation because you want to, be, to bring more clarity to this situation. Now, what may be affecting you in your subconscious? The fact that they have not talked, expressed feelings or an apology. Let's see about what is the overall energy for Scorpio. I think you will get lots of options. So, if you are in the dating phase, it's, uh, it's good to get out of the house and try to to be in the game to to try to date as many people as possible because i think you will get attention or maybe online dating i don't know but you will have lots of attention you will have lots of options this is the overall energy maybe some of you are getting lots of attention as well now let's see how do you view the situation with this past person? You think they gave up completely because it felt so heavy as a connection. Let's see more details. You want to avoid being in a connection with a person that does not love you back or the love is not mutual. You don't want to be in a superficial connection. Now, your focus here is the Six of Swords. You may have realized somehow that the past connection was not uh, worth it. Or maybe you deserve more. That's why your focus may be to try to cut the tie with the past and move forward and find a better new partner. Now let's see about your current, uh, their current energies. What are their current energies? They seem very guarded, and the bottom is Son of Sun in the reverse. So, this person is an overthinker, is still thinking a lot. They are moving very, very slowly towards you, or the progress is very little. They seem quite guarded. And I think it is because they believe the connection will not make them happy anymore. Now let's see, will they take any actions towards you, if any? Will they take any actions towards you, if any? At the bottom we have the moon. This person does not know what they want. In fact, because one day they want to take initiative and make a leap, take a leap of faith and make a move forward you, but they are so immature in love with the page of wands, sometimes insecure. They may not feel quite secure and confident in themselves to approach you again. That's, a, that's why I see lots of hesitation. They want to one day, the other day they stop, they think a lot, they feel guarded, maybe this connection will not make me happy again. That's what they keep thinking. 
but it's not that they have forgotten the past connection. They still think about one day to take that uh, phone and call you or come and visit you. Something like that. They want to take a leap of faith and take the initiative, but then they are stepping back, uh, lacking the confidence to do it. Because they feel confused, anxious, they think the connection is a failure, maybe they will be, they will get rejected by you. So they even may be thinking they will get rejected by you if they came back. They fear commitment as well. So a person that lacks the confidence to approach you. But let's see in the extended how this reading goes. If you want to watch the extended, you can find it now in the description box below. See you the next reading and bye for now.